All right, Dry Canyon coming up today, which I'm guessing is just chock full of water by the sound of it. And there's all 200 of the gems we collected in the home world. And now the subworlds are going to start getting bigger, which means they're going to start taking longer to beat. And now we're going to, in fact, we got, uh, how many gems do we have to get here today? 400. No slouch. And hey, we're 17% of the way through the game if uh, you're interested in that figure. So now we got 400 gems to get quite a ways to go here. And a dragon egg at this level, which is uh, kind of a pain to get, actually. I think we're about to be shot at if we're not careful. So, uh, moving right along after we were so rudely interrupted by a Gnork with a Gnun. Or a gun, just a gun, actually, probably would probably do the trick there. And if they have the shield up, you can just charge it because the flame won't cut the mustard. I, uh, did I get the... Yeah, I got the, uh, I got the gem for that. But I need to, uh, backtrack a little because I believe that's where old Mr. Dragon Egg is going to be. It's going to be, uh, we're going to have to run around a particular one of these giant tower things right here. I don't think it's this one. I think it's off to the... Uh, well, I was going to say it's off to the left, but that's just a wall right there. There we go. It's going to be around the way back here. And we're going to run around and chase this guy, so we got to be careful of the water because it is easy to fall into if you make your turns too sharp. I think I'm close enough to flame him at this point, so uh, there we go. One third of the dragon eggs in the game collected. And uh, most of them are going to be magic crafters, so we won't deal a whole lot with dragon eggs here so much. Want to turn the camera before that guy gets the jump on you. Okay, and it's important here to make sure you've got all the gems on the ground level because this place is kind of circular. It's easy to uh, miss things if you're not careful. Uh, Sparks is okay, so we don't have to get the uh, loping billy goats or anything. And you can try to flame the cactus, but it'll just shake it off. That's right, Mr. Cactus, you shake it off. You're an inspiration to us all. Yeah, you bring that gun out. <laughs> Sucker. Let's uh, jump up and rescue... Hey, Conan! Thank you for releasing me. Now can I get back to my late night show, please? Uh, let's go ahead and save, because uh, this can at times be a somewhat tricky level. Thank you, Miss Safe Fairy with the awesome pointy wand. Let's go across the way. <laughs> you should have timed it sometime before I was jumping up there, sucker. And now these uh these buzzards, they're kind of nasty. You want to get them before they come at you because uh they'll just kind of turn you up like on your back. And these guys you just have to flame from a distance so that like the very tip of your flame is touching them. And of course it would behoove us to uh take a shortcut or not a shortcut, do a little backtracking. Backtracking is not a shortcut. So let's uh go up the steps here and I think we're gonna want to wait before we go the yeah we don't want to go out there just yet uh, there is a lot to do out there in that segment but we're going to skip it for now because we're gonna get a few other things first and uh, we're gonna do some other segments get a key to a treasure chest that's gonna be out there so uh, that way we can move around without uh, wasting a whole lot of time and hey there's another easy to find dragon up on a step this one is Boris Boris he's dragon trapped in crystal Dry Canyon rewards good gliders. You are a good glider, eh, Spyro? I was born to glide. <laughs> In Soviet Russia, Canyon glides you, huh? 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 But there's nothing to get from... Well, there might be something to get from there. Let's, uh, let's check it out in greater detail, why don't we? Go up to the top of the peak here and see what we glide over to. Perhaps that, uh, door over there, probably. I, I sense good things coming from over there. Whee! But that's not the hardest jump we'll have to make around here. It's a fairly easy one, actually. There we go. And, uh, anything on the, uh, ledge out here that I'm missing? Yeah. Those would be pretty easy to miss if I wasn't paying close, careful attention. But let's, uh, flow back over here and, uh little bit of familiar ground, but it won't take us long to regain our place. Let's find our bookmark and pick up from where we left off in the pages of Spyro, and it was right about here. 
at charging Vulture Face. There we go. And yes, he will smack you flat with the uh, Vulture if you are not careful. And there is, I think, our first 25 gem. The Magenta ones. They're the uh, single most valuable gem in the game at 25 or 25 reds. And here's our return home thing, but we have a lot that we need to do because we uh, skipped a whole big portion in the hopes that, uh, oh, hey, hey, ah, that shouldn't have taken like that. That was a mean hit. First of all, there's this guy over here. And I think we can get back there from here if we uh, make the jump correct. I th Did I hear something break down there? I think I actually missed some gems down there, come to think of it. What's... What's down there? Ah, uh, maybe not. I won't think any more of it right now. Unless there's something I'm missing at the end, then uh, I'm not going to worry uh, too much about it. Uh, there's one of these now. One of these, I think, is... Is there one that's shorter than the other and I'm able to get on top of it? Perhaps not. Let's see. What's, uh... Can I get over there? From here, I'm guessing I probably don't want to attempt that kind of jump. But you can glide over. No, 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 no. That's the one that requires the really good glide that we uh, haven't done yet, which I could have actually uh, done earlier. Now that I think about it, I think I'm going to want to get up here and uh, go back to that spot. And yes, uh, this is a fairly impressive glide right here. But like I was saying. It's not the hardest one we want to make. But what we want to do is we want to go outside. And uh, there were three gyms over here just kind of sitting by themselves. But that's kind of a hint as to where you need to go. What we're going to do is we're going to jump off and we're going to cut around the wall. And there we go. That's how you get to here. It's the only way you can uh, reach this spot in this level. So you have to take those red gyms as your cue. I almost, uh, almost forgot about that. Maximos is his name. And breaking out of crystal is Incredible his game. glide, Spyro. I thought I'd be stuck here forever with those ugly vultures standing on my head. Those birds might look tough, but they're pretty tasty. Flame broiled with a pinch of salt. Ah, uh, yes, yes. The Academy is going to play you off now, thanks. And there's a key. Good to get this key right here, right now, before we go off to the uh, final part of the level. We don't have very many gems at this point, we're, but we're about to get tons of them. Oh, well, we got 247, more than half, so, uh, uh, I undershot it a little. Whatevs. Not too worried about that. We're going to charge back this way now. Going to come back to that little river jump right here. Just charge jump right over it and come back here. And this is going to help us glide to the final part of the level. We're going to collect a bunch of treasures and then call it a day from there. There's one more dragon off over this way. Okay. All right, got both at once. Excellent. And you, you die now. I have nothing nice to say about you. All right, guys, wake up and prepare to die. Okay, wow. I was expecting to get hit with that strategy. I probably should have just charged through two of them and come back and hit the other one. Those vultures are tough to see coming sometimes. They take off fairly early. They have, they have really good vision. And there's the final dragon right ahead. Let's charge up and see what he's got to say. Ivor. Is that you, Spyro? Are you the young dragon I've been hearing so much about? Ever since you're a wee puff of smoke, we've known... Uh... You've known? Ah, uh, I forget. <laughs> Some of the dragons are genuinely funny. Not many of them, but some of them. And uh, this is a good place to save, so you start from here in uh, case you screw up a jump or something, because that's a uh, very likely possibility here. So uh, let's go ahead and let's go out this door, and we want to go around to this edge first, because this is a dead end, and there is a bunch out here other than vultures and a few gems. You are going to, uh, yeah, you're going to plummet to your death. Your death is going to be slow and painful. <laughs> and plus, I stole your money. Oh, hey, vultures. I didn't expect you around this side. Okay. Now we're going to make our way up to the top, unless there's, a, unless there's a step over here that I need to be apprised of. No, no, pretty much no. Okay. 
Boom! Okay, we want to be careful here. Gonna make our way up the steps, and we're gonna do a little bit of superfluous gliding first to get a one up, obviously, because isn't, isn't that what I'm all about? I don't think there are enemy, in, enemy enemies up here on the roof. Enemy, 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 enemy. Okay, don't hurt yourself. All right, we're gonna glide over here first and get the one up, and then we're going to get so oh, not quite. But I'll be damned if I'm not going for it. So uh, maybe I should have uh, flamed it on the way over there. That would have kept me from just kind of popping right over it. Let's uh, try that again. Let's uh, flame it. There we go. Made that nice and easy. We're up to ten little lives. So now we got to go over here again because there's no way to get to the other part from there. We want to get to one more important part, which is going to lead us to the rest of the gyms in the stage. We're going to come over here. And now there are boxes full of gyms and fireworks. These things do explode, and they do harm Spyro. So when you set one off, you want to get out of the way and wait for it. <coughs> sorry. Yeah, sorry. To Ow. That cough actually hurt my uh, torso a little been sick lately, so uh, some of my uh, coughs have been pretty intense, and uh, they, they've been kind of hurty too. Been trying not to do that on camera, but can't always avoid it. And now we're going to float out here for the remainder of the gems in the level. And you want to make sure you have all the gems in the level before you get to this point, because once you get to that little mesa out there, there's no coming back. So we want to come and we want to glide out here, and this is why you want to have the key around. Stopped right in front of us, stuck the landing. And we're going to set these off, and this is a good place to end the level right here. You can't make it to the return home vortex from here, but you can certainly exit by way of the pause menu, which, quite frankly, that's a lot more convenient. Only 12 gems left, and... Oh, no, 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 no. No, 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 no. I'm missing two gems. Now, where am I going to find these? But maybe I can make it back from here. Okay, good. I thought... I must be thinking of another level where you can't make it back from some giant flow. Where am I... Uh, now, where am I missing these things? I don't want to make too big a search out of this on camera. Because, obviously, we could be here a while if I'm... Uh, if I don't remember my calculations correctly, I thought I'd gone all of them. I thought I heard some going off earlier. Maybe those were the ones I missed. But you can always get out of this little segment of the level by coming this way. And exiting stage narrow corridor right here. Right here. So now we're going to pop down right here. And we're going to come to the beginning of the level and we're going to try to find the gems we missed. Which, uh... Could be a while, so uh, I'm going to heal up Sparks with these uh, special little goat guys. And we'll be back in just a second. Back to yellow, alright. I found it. It is actually down this hallway. I must not have gotten it when I bumped one of those guys earlier. Sparks is slacking on the job. He's sleeping on it. But that's 400 right there, so uh, that happens a lot to me sometimes. I'm uh, surprised it took this long to happen in the in the series actually, but uh, there are a lot of times when I think I found everything and I'm just missing one straggler. So uh, why don't we top it off there for today now that we finally found everything and we'll just float off into the distance what seems to be off this cliff. But we will save ourselves at the last second, exit the level and then tomorrow we will head on over to, uh, I think Cliff Town is the next one. And that one is a lot of fun, a lot of nice little hidden things there. You really gotta look, jump around, explore the joint, Let's run over to it now, why don't we? Yep, it's over here, sitting out in the open. Cliff Town, we'll beat it tomorrow. We'll beat Cliff Town, that is. Get your mind out of the gutter, please.